We grind hard, hustle smart, got our vision clear. Bell Street Publisher, we pioneer. From ink to dreams, we make it and know. Voices of the streets, yeah, we in the zone. Black kings rising, breaking the mold. This the trap, soul tear, watch the story unfold. Rodney Harris, uh, author, um, AI professional, right? Um, what we're going to do on this channel is we're in the process of producing some TV series type shows with AI. We got a couple movies coming out at the end of the year with AI. As much as we can do with AI with it, that's what we're doing. We already produced like all of the music. We compo composed all of the music with, with AI, a uh, company called Udio. And a lot of the graphics and stuff we did on a company called Mid Journey. Uh, so that's what we want to do on this channel. But what we also want to do is we want to show people our process on what it takes to learn it, what it takes to use it, about how much money it costs. It's a lot more costly than what people think. Yeah, if you're doing like, you know, three to five uh, second clips, you know, it, it, it's easy to do. But when you're doing a 15 minute episode, that's a, that's a different ball game. So what we're going to try to do on this channel is educate people more about AI. Everybody's so terrified with AI. Uh, I wrote a book right here. Um, it is called, let's show it a little better. It's called Echoes from the Past. And how that came, how that came about is back in November of 2023, or 2022, uh, a company called AI, or uh, OpenAI, which I didn't know anything about at the time, uh, sent me an email just out of the blue wanting to see if I wanted to beta test their new product, which went on to be chat gpt right um so when chat gpt came out uh january about i'm sitting around thinking i, I knew how powerful it was because you know playing with it that long and, I, and i'm thinking about you know what can i do i knew it was gonna change things uh and i'm thinking about what can i do with it you know how can i make money and all of that stuff right which is what people need to be thinking about. You know, people are thinking about it replacing their jobs and stuff like that, which it will. It's going to replace a lot of people's jobs. But what it will also do if you learn it and and use it to your advantage, what it's also going to do is also going to provide a lot of new jobs for people too, you know, uh, prompting. If you know how to prompt, and what prompt is, is when you type in what you want. You know, I'm looking for a female, 30 years old, long hair, dressed in a white blouse, uh, running down the street. Hit submit. That's a prompt. The better you get at prompting, the more you're going to be an asset to your company, you're gonna be an asset to you. So um, I would tell people, and I tell people all the time, learn how to use it to better what you're doing. You War and peace clashing in the streets. Ah. Heavy beat strapped with the heat. Ah. Driving life, trying to live it right. Ah. Night, 
savage fight when we taking that ground. Hearts race in this four torn place, ah. Uh. Street kings never back erase, ah. Uh. Chasing dreams through the sound of screams, ah. Uh. In the night, echoes and the beams, ah. Uh. Clashing in the streets ah. Heavy beats trapped with the heat ah. Driving life, trying to live it right ah. In the night, battles come to light Yeah, mixed gear on the city light I wrote this book and I was on a lot of author um, platforms where we were talking about, I, I remember one, it was a group of eight authors and they kind of was looking at me like, you're not really an author. You know, and I'm kind of looking at them like, you need to use this, which I told them, you need to use this to your favor, you know? Instead of staying old school, that's it's the equivalent of if you're staying old school when cell phones came out and you said, which a lot of people did, I'm not, I'm not putting that up to my phone, my head. I'm not taking that. I'll stay with my home phone. Well, imagine how many people still have their home phone. And imagine if you were in business, how far behind you were when you decided to stay with your home phone or your business phone and not use a smartphone, you know? So what I tell people all the time is, no, I did not, uh, AI did not write my book. I came up with the idea. I came up with the questions. And what the book is about is I sit there and I thought, how can I use this? You know, what can I do? What kind of project can I do? And what I ended up doing is I know that AI is something that can search all the information. And yes, you do have to fact check. It's getting a lot better, but you still got to fact check if you can put your name on stuff. So, so I said, hey, you know what? I wonder if it could go collect all the information that it could find on people like Ida B. Wells, you know, people like Fred Hampton, people that I kind of heard of, but I didn't know a lot about them. And I said, you know what? Once it collects the information, I'm going to see if I can ask Ida B. Wells some questions. Not only about what she was thinking then, about what she's thinking now. And so what I did is I asked the AI, can you gather up all the information you can about Ida B. Wells? And can you ask the, can you answer these questions as I ask, not as them, but as you think they would answer the question? And so the whole book is about an interview style with Black civil rights leaders and icons and asking them questions about why they did what they did, what do you what do they feel like now? What do you feel like needs to change? And and that's what the book is about. It's about 88 pages. I made it where it's an easy read. And I got it into a couple school systems. I'm getting ready to start pushing it like really, really hard. Um it's doing well. I've been to a lot of lectures where I just I answer the questions that I can answer, you know? Like people ask me this and that about AI, and I tell them, you know, I'm not an expert, 
in it. What I can tell you is as a business person, what I use it for, you know, emails, writing sales letters, writing professional business letters. I just type in what I want and then I'm like, can you write this better than me? Because I know it can, you know. So uh, that's what we're using it for. Uh, right now, I'm going to go to the promo of our new series. Right. War and peace clashing in the streets. Ah. Heavy beat strapped with the heat. Ah. Driving life, trying to live it right. Ah. In the night, battles come to light. Ah. Savage fight when we taking that ground. Hearts race in this war torn place. Ah, street kings never back erase. Ah, hope you enjoyed that. That's a series that's coming out really soon. We we putting a screenplay together right now, writing the script. We got a whole year's episode done already. Episodes done already. So look for that here on our YouTube page. Uh, we're going to start being more social on our social media pages. Uh, it's Bell Street Publishing. Um, so look for us. Uh, look for the book right here. Right there. Yeah, there you go. Look for the book right there. Uh, I'll put a link where you can go get it and uh, they'll send it to you or, you know, just contact us on our website. And I'll put that right here. And that's www.bell, B-E-L-L-S-T, publishing.com. So I just wanted to come on real quick. I'm going to do a lot of these. But like I said, Ours will be more about keeping you updated on what's going on with the series and showing you how we do what we do as far as writing the screenplay, writing the episodes, coming up with the music. Uh, we're going to show you everything, you know, because a lot of people on here, they're talking about it, but they're not really using it. It's a couple of really good people on here that I learned a lot from, and I'm talking about on YouTube. Uh, but a lot of people were just trying to sell, you know, affiliates and stuff like that. Um, you know, we want to just educate people more um, than we trying to sell stuff to them. You know, really want to sell them the book. Oh, this book right here, um, this is a friend of mine. This is an outstanding book. Outstanding book of Y'all go get this. It's uh, Follow the Tracks. This is, we we would love to turn this book into a movie too. Uh, we trying to get the rights from them. Uh, this is a, a, a excellent book. So we're going to put the link where you can get this too. Y'all go get it. Uh, support authors, you know, because a lot of them uh having a really hard time right now. Like I said, when I was on these lectures, a lot of them was looking at me like, you're not a real old school author. And I was like, no, I'm not. But what I'm trying to tell you is you have to you have to use the new technology because if you don't, yes, you are writing. It'll take you a year to finish a book. And in that same amount of time, I didn't did 20 books. So, you know, it's really, uh, it's really about selling, you know, how book, how your book is selling. Um, uh, and if you got 20 books out there selling versus one book, um, uh, yeah, you can, you can have a hell of a book that sell millions of copies, but 
most authors don't do that. So what I was telling them was, you need to look into it. And if you, if all you use it for is to put out better emails faster, you know, you can sit there and you can write a business letter and it'll take you 15, 20 minutes where in that same amount of time, I done wrote like five or 10 business letters and got them all emailed out and everything else. And it looks real professional. So um, we're gonna come on, we're gonna do this. Um, thanks for tuning in. Like I said, like it, subscribe to it. We're gonna start building this up. Um, so, you know, hit that, hit that, uh, subscribe building uh, button and um, we'll see you again later. Rodney Ayers, author, producer, AI. Love it. Thank you. Bye.